What are they doing? The readings are as big as those at the library when we crossed over. I think it's safe to assume that the machine they're working on was not built for a benign purpose. It's an orrery, a device typically used for predicting planetary alignment. In this case, it appears to actually be aligning dimensions. I, for one, do not want the dimensions to align. Not this close to Christmas. That would put a damper on the holidays. How do we shut that thing down? The motion of those devices seems to be generating some sort of energy. Hard to tell, though. What if we try blocking those things? I can calculate 54 likely outcomes. We'd survive three of them. That beats our usual odds. Unfortunately, you're correct. Let's do it. It looks like the movement of those spheres is stabilizing the interior structure. What if they stop moving? So far, Gooby Island has been a slime tether amusement park. Why should that change now? Lock those spheres down, man! We gotta stop those balls from moving. I mean, you know what I mean. Yes, you did. How come people smart enough to use science always try to take over the universe? Huh? Ega, great. Anyone? Didn't they? Wait, those planets are aligning. I'm not so sure this is the safest course of action. I think we found the source of the black slime, Winston. I wasn't that curious! The whole room's filling up! Get to higher ground! All right, gentlemen, it's official. This was a bad idea. The stench is horrible. Smells like the Fulton fish market when they've got fish. Wait, I know that dumpster. A putrid mass of hatred, bile, and anger. Not exactly Mr. Sunshine, is it? This is the part where we do what we do. Blow it up. Yo! Get him in the eyes! Hit his eyes, rookie! You know what you're doing to We've got to cut off his visine. Somebody chop some onions. Giving me the evil eye, huh? <laughs> it's got to be vulnerable somewhere! Statistically speaking, that's not entirely accurate. Statistically speaking, we better hope it is! Okay, fair enough. What about that inaccessible anterior nodule? That glowing thing on its head? That is its head, isn't it? I'm not sure that matters. How can we get to it? Hey, rookie, run around and look delicious, will ya? There it is. Concentrate your fire on that node. Hit it right there! It doesn't like that at all! He's taking the bait! Why are you shooting everything but the glowing thing on its head? The nodes are closed. The ghosts are trapped in Mandala. Right where they belong. Our boy Evo Shandor didn't factor in that he was messing with the Ghostbusters. Ha ha ha! Yeah, Peck made the same mistake. We're gonna have to have a long talk with him. Don't forget that Peter's girlfriend is a Shandor. I'm gonna have a very long talk with her. You guys need to get down to the shore and fast! I don't know how much longer I can hold her. The whole island's sinking! 
Ray, keep the motor running. We are coming at you fast. Peter, get out of there. How was it? Was it cool? What did it look like? Did you get any samples? Did it have multiple eyes? Shut up. Oh, thank God you're here. What's going on, Janine? Where's Alyssa? She's gone. They took her. One minute everything was fine, the next it was chaos. Ghosts flying everywhere. Janine, slow down. Start from the beginning. Okay. Well, I was a little late this morning because one of the heels on my favorite pair of pumps broke, and Lester's was out of my favorite tea. You know how I love my chamomile. Well, and... Okay. Maybe not the beginning. Start where things went haywire around here. Okay. Okay. Somebody jumped me from behind. And before I passed out, I heard Alyssa struggling and yelling, No! And the last thing I remember was the screams of the dead and damned echoing in my brain. So either there was a mass escape from Rikers... Or someone shut down our containment grid again. Again? Just like Peck threatened to do. It's funny. I always knew that Peck was a pencil-necked bureaucratic prick. But I never pegged him as an evil occultist. But where did he take her? And where are all the ghosts? Cause, no offense, but if all the ghosts we've ever caught just escaped, I'm clocking out. Yeah, they would be awfully mad at us. Exactly. It's generally a bad idea for the guards to hang out in the cell blocks just after a prison break. This just in. As authorities continue to supervise the Thanksgiving evacuation of Manhattan, increasingly powerful tremors are rocking Central Park. The question is, where are the Ghostbusters? Uh, tell you what, kind of a nice day. Why don't we go to Central Park? Could round up some ghosts, save the girl, get back in time for a nap. Okay, the Ghostbusters ride again. Oh, hi. Really? Mm-hmm. If I told him that if they start evacuating Manhattan that I don't plan on coming in on Monday, and he says, and he says, I've already used all my floating holidays this year, right? I tell him, Dr. Van, now is the catastrophic of evil. exodus of the city doesn't count as a floating holiday. No, it doesn't. I looked it up. So he hands me the employee handbook and tells me to look again and that what is and isn't covered is very clearly defined. What? Yeah, it was in there, in his handwriting, in pencil. He wrote it in when he asked me to get his coffee. Anyway, I can take a half day on Monday if they evacuate the city. All right. Goodbye. On a mountain of skulls in the castle of pain, I shall sit on a throne of blood once more. May an army of demons devour you. Have you savored the exquisite anguish of tortured souls? Salty. I wouldn't mind running with these other fools away from the trouble. Where's the fun in that? Any guesses on where we'll find Peck and Alyssa? I suspect that we're going to need the Super Slammer up there. No telling how powerful Peck has grown. That means we gotta take the Ecto-1. I'll drive. Maybe the trainee should drive. Nah! nah. Thanks, Winston. Any ideas? Ah! 
Junior's pretty spry, even with that hundred pounds of proton accelerator. Ow! That was... that was ow there! Make your way around to the other side and open this gate for us. Atmospheric disturbance? That's right. At Dana Barron's building, the night she turned into a dog. source in our containment unit. The energy of the escape ghosts from our grid might be enough to produce a cross-dimensional event in itself. Yes, and with Alyssa here, I'm sure her Shandor ancestors aren't far behind.
all right? How's that gate coming? I'll go with the intern. Nobody should wander around alone in this place. We'll meet you guys a little further on. They aren't very happy about us being here. You saw them too, didn't you? They think they're sneaky. Let's spread out and flank them. Could be trouble. Oh, I'm ectoplasmically saturated. Easy there, Bulldog. Give the rest of us a chance. It's on your left! Oh, great. I'm gonna need another iron shower. Oh, disgusting! But not entirely without signs of the It's not alone!
This is among my least favorite sensations. Young blood, it's all you.
behind you. Solid, kid! There's the key! It's too heavy to carry ourselves. Get it back to the gate so we can keep going! Would you? Necromantic shockwave summoned Gozer back to our plane. Why didn't he assume a more effective destructor form immediately? I mean, the Marshmallow Man is scary, sure, but there has to be a better way to destroy the world. It's simple. When he enters our plane of existence, he must be locked into that form from our first encounter. One destructor form per god per dimension. I like it. Sounds like the kind of symmetry these things tend to operate on. Hey, so maybe I didn't choose such a bad destructor after all, huh? Look, up there. It's getting worse. This isn't the Central Park I'm used to. You still have your wallet? Either we're in trouble or we're dinner. Is there a difference? Hey, we have a test of proton packs in the ring. That's what the recruit is doing right now. Great! Wait a minute. I'm wearing one too. That's true, Ray. How's it going so far? Do you smell any burning or experience any painful tingling? You'll be the first one to know. Or the second. Strike! Take those flyers out! They're coming out of the ground! We've got to smash the coffins while they're airborne! Otherwise, we have to deal with these! Yeah. 
at all graceful. Close.
taunting me! Above you! Could be trouble! Well, hello there. Great. You guys all right? Man, there ain't nothing dead in this grave. Thanks for joining the party. They're throwing everything they have at us to stop us from getting to that mausoleum. That's as far as I can go. You guys got a clear path for me. Ray, readings here are extremely unstable. Energy from the mandala and the escaped ghost is building up to a flashpoint. We don't have much time. Yeah, that's good. Hey, holding on. Well, I guess we're going in there. We don't have a lot of choice. Man, the graves pushing up through here really did a number on this place. Walter Pack is going to have a lot to answer to from the city park department. If we can prevent the apocalypse, that is. Use your PKE. More than I expected. You've got him on the rope! Your team! Oh, close one! Watch out, would you? Make a hole! 
I like your style, kid. We've tried everything. This metal is psychonically charged, rendering it effectively indestructible. Uh -huh. Well, in such an extreme situation, I suppose it's possible to cause it harm, but I don't think anything we have is going to make a dent in it. Then what's our plan? Ray, you two check out that side. I think I'm picking up something odd here. What's your take on this? An indestructible gate attached to a damaged frame. A few concussive hits and the hinges might just break loose. 